Hello, I'm Peppa Pig. Would you like to be my friend? <sighs> Peppa cannot wait to tell everyone her news. Mummy, Daddy, George! Hello, Peppa. Hello, Peppa. <laughs> I'm so excited. Why is that, Peppa? I'm going to meet my new friend. A new friend? Yes. <gasps> and who might this new friend be? I don't know. They're new, silly. <laughs> I'm going to show them Snowy Mountain, the beach, everything. Even Potato City. Peppa is excited to play with her new friend and explore all the brilliant places in her world. That's a good idea, Peppa. Yes, Daddy. It's going to be so much fun. So when is your new friend coming to play, Peppa? Very soon. I can't wait to play with them. Dinosaur. It looks like Mr. Dinosaur wants to play with Peppa's new friend, too. You have arrived at the playgroup, a place to learn and play with Pepper and her friends. Hello everyone, this is my new friend. Hello! It will look great on Pepper's wall. Lovely. It will look great on Pepper's wall. Three, two. One. Splendid. Now we go from big to small. Two, one, three. Now it's all jumbled up. Uh, why don't you try it again? One, two, three. This goes from small to big. Very good. <laughs> Children, today is a very special day. Do you know what day it is? Is it your birthday? No, it's not my birthday, Danny. Anyone else want to guess? How about you? Good guess. Today is sports day. 
Whoa! What is sports day? Sports day is a very important day. Everyone must do sports today so we can all stay healthy. Let's go to the running track. Ooh! All right, children. Start running on my count. Three, two, one, go! Come on, children! Very good, Peppa. And your friend is very fast. One last effort, children. You're almost at the finish line. Finished. Oh, congratulations. You all did a very good job. You all deserve a trophy today, don't you think, Peppa? Susie? Pedro? And you too, of course. I hope we all learned about the importance of sports today. But can we still run if it's not sports day? Oh, of course. You can always run. Running is fun. <laughs> <laughs> We need to get him down. Dr. Hamster will be so worried that he's missing. Yes, but how do we do that? It's too high up. Let's get Madam Gazelle. She'll know what to do. Madam Gazelle will know what to do to get Tiddles the tortoise back down from the tree. Let's find her in the classroom. We need to do something. Hang on, Tiddles. 
We're going to get you down in no time. Oh, impossible. It's too high for me. Peppa, why don't you and your friend go and find me a ladder so I can climb up the tree and rescue Tiddles? There's a ladder right outside the playgroup. Help Peppa find the ladder so Madame Gazelle can use it to get Tiddles down. Let's go this way. was talking about. You found it. Good job. Oh, here you are, Tiddles. Let's get you down, shall we? There you go, Tiddles. No more climbing today. Hooray! I'll call Dr. Hamster and tell her Tiddles is safe. Thank you all. You did a wonderful job. Now, let's make sure Tiddles doesn't climb up again. Tiddles? Gone again? Oh, Tiddles. <laughs> <laughs> Good job. Now Tiddles is safe and everyone is having a great time. Not quite that old, George. Dinosaur? Ooh, it looks very nice. I think I would make a great queen. I would sit around all day and eat all <laughs> the ice cream I wanted. It appears that you and Peppa are now royalty, and you can have anything you ask for. Is there anything you would like, Your Majesties? Yes. We want ice creams, please. Of course, Queen Peppa. I'm sure you would make a great queen, Pepper. Dinosaur! Oh, 
Yes, George, it's a real dinosaur. One that lived many, many years ago. <laughs> dinosaur! Are you with us, George? Dinosaur! It seems that George has found his favourite room. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome, welcome. Are you here to join me on the trip to the moon? Jump aboard the rocket train. Mr. Rabbit is the tour guide. He knows a lot about the universe. Are we really going to the moon? No, Pepper. It's just pretend. That's right, Pepper. It's just a pretend moon. Now, all passengers, hold on tight to your seats. We're about to take off. Three, two, one, blast off! All right then, does anybody know what these things hanging from the ceiling are? Are they planets? Precisely. And do you know the name of the planets? Oh, um, not really. Oh, I know one, the Earth! Very good, Daddy Pig. This is the Earth, we also have Venus. Mars, Neptune. What's that? Ah, this is a satellite. Satellites fly around the world so we can have TVs and the internet. Really? But how do they do that? It's all magic. And we've reached the end. Please exit the rocket and continue to the next room where you'll see the moon. Welcome to the moon. Gravity on the moon is much weaker, so we can jump much higher. Ooh. The moon has less gravity than the Earth, which means you'd feel lighter and be able to jump higher. Whee! Try it out. Strap in and jump up. It's a wonderful day to get some good views from up in the hot air balloon. Yes, please!
Peppa's house. visit my granny and grandpa. Their house is just ahead. Let's keep walking this way. 